Welcome to this video. In the previous video, we saw some examples related to area of similar triangles. In this video, we will see another interesting example based on this. In the given triangle PQR, if XY is parallel to QR and the area of triangle PXY is half the area of triangle PQR, then find the value of QX by PQ. According to the question, we know that XY is parallel to QR and the area of triangle PXY is half the area of triangle PQR. Hence, from equation 1, we can say that the area of triangle PQR will be twice the area of triangle PXY. Observing the figure, we can say that XY is parallel to QR, PQ is the transversal, so angle PXY will be equal to the angle PQR. Can you say if any other angle of triangles PXY and PQR are equal? Correct. In triangle PXY and triangle PQR, angle P is the common angle. So angle XPY will be equal to the angle QPR. So according to the AA criteria of similarity of triangles, we can say the triangle PXY and triangle PQR are similar triangles. Since we know that the ratio of the areas of two similar triangles is equal to the square of the ratio of their corresponding sides, hence, from triangles PXY and PQR, we see that the ratio of their areas will be equal to the square of the ratio of their corresponding sides PX and PQ. With the help of equation 1, We see that by taking the square root of both the sides, we get the square root of 2 multiplied by Px is equal to Pq. Since we have to find the value of Qx by Pq, then can you tell us how we will write the segment Px? Correct answer. Segment Px can be written as Pq minus Qx. On solving this, we can say that the value of Qx by Pq is obtained as the square root of 2 minus 1 upon the square root of 2. So I hope you would have understood the relationship between the area of similar triangles and their sides.